everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Lanis, but people call me Lonnie, Lonnie Love, Miss Love. For those of you who have followed me on IG, you know that I have dyed my hair several different colors and it's super, super fun to me. I actually love, love, love the experiment. Today will be a video on how I am going to go from black to black. What they say, go blonde or go home. And I'm not trying to go home. So I'm definitely going blonde. I wasn't really trying to use bleach to go blonde. So for today, I will be using the Dark and Lovely Fade Resist. On the back, it gives you a color guide with the expected results. Um, I've used this before and I actually, actually really love it. So we're going to see if my hair takes. I also have some gloves, ladies. Nails. nails we have to protect the nails okay yes, if you're doing it by yourself you should definitely definitely have like a little mirror I also have the combs because i'm gonna need the combs to pluck out the curls first before i go dying it is always always important to pluck out the curls and pluck out your hair comb it out before you add the dye because if you add dye to non-combed out hair it will get tangled up. So you have to make sure that you do that as well. I also use this brush in which I take and I smooth out the color throughout my hair. Also using the gloves and massaging the color through your hair. Last but not least, it is important to use some type of grease, some type of Vaseline. I normally use some Vaseline and you have to put it around your edges because you do not want to burn your edges, especially if you're using bleach, you do not want to burn your edges. But anywho, make sure you use this base around your crown so that you can keep all that. So now I'm about to pluck out my hair. So I have my Vaseline. Now I am going around the perimeter of my hair with the Vaseline, making sure that I get behind my ears, I get my kitchen and everything because I do not want these chemicals to burn my skin. All right, so now my hair is fully plucked out. Make sure you have your gloves on. Then you're gonna mix your materials. This is the developer. This is gonna be the actual hair coloring. And because I'm going blonde, they actually gave me a color booster. This is used to lift the blonde to a lighter color. Will lift my hair to a lighter color. So these are my ingredients. I'm currently mixing the dye in into the developer. Now I'm putting the high lift color booster in there to brighten the blonde. Now it's time to shake up all the materials in the bottle and get it ready. Now I'm about to apply the dye to my hair, but wait. And this is where everything went wrong. You never bleach your edges first, y'all. You just don't start with your edges, okay? I had to learn the hard way, but good thing I was able to kind of fix it in the end. But keep watching, you'll see. Oh, as you can see, the color is already changing slowly but surely. It is important to take a comb and comb through your hair so that the dye can touch every inch, every piece of your hair. The color is all combed out throughout my head. I'm putting my cap on for 30 minutes. So this is the color that it came out to, which is not what I was going for. So I had to go to the store and get a whole nother box of dye. So we are gonna see how it turned out. <laughs> so you guys, this is the color that it came out to. Well, I guess it's giving peaches and cream or whatever. I'm not really feeling it like that. I always think that I'm gonna get a different outcome when I actually dye the hair. So, like I told you guys before, I did not like the color that it was. So, I let my hair breathe for the night. And I got up this morning and I went to the beauty supply store. And I got toner. I'm going to try 
this toner. I have used it before. Also, I will be using this developer, 40. Now I'm mixing the developer in with the toner, making sure that it's not too thick or it's not too runny, but just right to be applied to my hair. Now I'm just applying the dye to my hair, making sure that I'm getting my roots. Now I'm about to put a plastic bag over my head and allow it to sit for 30 minutes. So you guys, this is the final, final touch of my hair. It's actually really growing on me and I'm actually really loving the blonde. I feel like my edges are slowly but surely changing in order to match the rest of the hair. So I feel really good about that. Um, I got dolled up today. I did attend Spelman College. Shout out, it's our Founders Week this week. I am a Spelmanite class of 2019 and I love my alma mater and that's on period. So all my Spelman sisters, comment below, like and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching my video and I see you guys in my next video.